Hey everyone, this is Adam from Miller's Custom Guitars, and I have a new segment for you this week uh, that I want to call What's on the Bench. I want to do this uh, every once in a while when I have a really interesting guitar in the shop. This week is a really interesting guitar. I have uh, my friend Nick brought in his amazing Gretsch White Falcon. This is a 1981. This guitar is spectacular. And uh, he got this guitar as his birth year guitar. Um, and, oh, sorry, Nick. I let everyone know how old you are. <laughs> um, but this guitar is just amazing and gorgeous. And it plays great. Um, and it's in really, really good, good condition. Um, but it had some wiring issues uh, that I sorted out for him. Um, but one of the amazing things about this guitar is that it is in stereo, and some Gretsches have interesting stereo um, electronics where uh, one pickup goes to one output and the other pickup goes to another output, um, but that's not how this guitar works. This guitar has stereo outputs in that the pickups are actually split, in that the treble side of the pickup and the bass side of the pickup go to separate sides of that jack. And the jack is a stereo jack. And if you use a, uh, a TRS cable uh, like this and you split it, you can send those outputs to separate amps like I have set up here. And you can amplify those separately and get different sounds. And so that's how it works. The the electronics are kind of crazy, but basically, um, with this switch in the up position, the, the top side of your pickup will go to one amp, and the bottom side of your pickup will go to another amp, and this switch here will control your treble, and this will be like a neck position, both bridge and then this is a tone three-way position and a volume and then this switch here is a neck middle bridge for the for the bass side of these pickups and then a three-way toggle for tone and then a volume and it's really amazing and it sounds incredible and so I have my amps set up here I have the PV amp here which is set up for the treble side and I have my fender my vintage fender down here set up for the bass side I tried it both ways and I thought this sounded better I thought the the PV had a more focused sound for the treble the fender had a little bit more full sound for the bass tones and I just wanted to play for you a little bit and um, show you how it sounded and um, it, it's just really cool so I just wanted to play for you a little bit give you some sounds and show you how it sounded so I'll uh, throw it up for you, so I'll start with the neck pickup on both. And in case you don't believe me, I will turn off, this is the bass side here, and just the treble. That's coming out of the PV here. Then I can switch pickups. So now I have the 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 middle selection on just the treble. pickups.
one of the cool things that you can do with this is you can treat those signals differently, right? So my Princeton has tremolo. So I can turn the tremolo on my Princeton. So just on the bass. reverb or you could I could distort just the treble if I wanted to so I can turn the gain up on the treble so my my bass is clear thing that's really interesting is that if you turn off the PV so you can't hear the treble string so one thing you can do is you can slightly overhear other strings that are nearby so like I turned off the PV right now and I just have the fender going but you can't hear the high strings the treble strings but you know this G string you can sometimes you if you bend up you know you can kind of bleed over to it it's kind of cool I don't know I just think this guitar is amazing and I'm so excited to have been had the uh, opportunity to work on it so uh, yeah so anyway I do this job because I love working on guitars of all makes and shapes and sizes you know if you have a guitar that needs some work whatever it is i would love to work on your guitar and uh, do whatever work it needs so if you need some work hit me up otherwise i'll see you next time miller's custom guitars in sonora california